The intro song is like half the length of the other ones I've been playing. So quick. Broken Relic from the shop. Life is kind of good today. I'm glad to hear that. Why is my game lagging? Awfully. Game? Please respond. Perfected strike? Sure. Meat on the bone? Meat on the bone is sort of a broken relic. Arguably a broken relic. Now what do I do? Remove defend. Doesn't sound right. Hamax? Ironclad has Whirlwind. Chemex is fine if I find Whirlwind, and otherwise it's sort of bad. He Leopardly, he the Doe, he the Bootle, he Kinkles, he Rasagathy. Oof. He Brewies, he Wilson, he Fran, he Lazarus, he Jerk James, he Paco, he Scaracoast, he Kickfer, he Pipo, Cayenne, Rustida, he Longlist Ferret, he Pattern Shirt. <laughs> nice to you. I like this Lark game muggling. And by nice to you, I presumably mean not nice to you. The problem is, like, there's lots of stuff I can do, but I don't really want to remove a strike right now all that much. So. Oh. I guess I card remove strike and feel no pain, maybe. Fine. It's an okay shop. My number is 34, which means if I'm below 46, it would be beneficial for me to just tank some damage. But I am at 47. So not quite there yet. I have a lot of two-cost shit. This is typical of Ironclad. I just take an uppercut since I have a meat on the bone and I didn't have a bash upgrade. Hey, Marble Key. Uppercut synergizes with wanting to sock your opponent in the face. Who would want that, though? We're very gentle here at Jorbs.tv. 34 is my number. Got there. Gonzo. You see power through, you take power through. There's nothing, like, super wrong with seeing and taking power through. Nothing super wrong with that. I go to 20, which means I heal all the way to 38. Probably take a bit more damage still, but... Have I ever met a politician IRL? Yep. I've drawn every two-cost card in my deck at the same time. Nice. <laughs> yeah, the Lucis, he ginger guy, he robot testicle, he shed Orion. Brought man. Algorithm hello.
I think that might be the first time I've played Perfected Strike. No, I played it against a Laos once. Thanks for the 10 months robotistical law. Yes, Fowo, hey Axia. Fossilized Helix also a pretty good defensive relic. Hmm, maybe I just take Seeing Rod here. Or Flame Barrier. I'm gonna take Flame Barrier. I have, um... Hmm, this reminds me of the Silent Run I played two days ago. Where I just took, like, three two-cost cards in Act 1 and didn't get a fourth energy and died. Flame Barrier is a pretty strong card. It's big in the Korean uh, meta. Maybe. I am back to pretty much full health. Give me this card. I ended up playing a deck centered around block cards somehow after taking my Perfected Strike and Meat on the Bone. Not weak this turn. Hey, London. Exploding pot was for like five health or something there. Wasn't much, but wasn't nothing either. Alright, I'll take a seeing run. I was pretty close to taking the last one. I am excited at the prospect of Sneko Eyes. So I'm not gonna upgrade seeing red right now. Can I have my exploding potion back? Advanced hallway fights want to know my location. Apparently. This one could have been worse than this, believe it or not. Want to take four damage, which means just hitting. One of them needs to hit me once, basically. Because I have Tungsten Rod. And I'm back to full health again. Uh... Okay. I'm gonna have to play damage when I draw damage in this fight. It's strange that you can't get good at Watcher without getting worse at the other characters. I think that's just how Watcher is, maybe. Perhaps. I do feel somewhat similar myself. Hey, Thunder's Fury. Oh my god, it's an oddly smooth sound. <laughs> These relics. These relics do not take very much damage from uh, enemies. 
Vitalicize is non-terrible here. I really need a whirlwind. I like that I can upgrade Metallicize. Guess I could like upgrade Perfected Strike. Not really sold on that. Probably take Pandora's box if it's offered. Relics don't do a lot of damage. We'll work on that. Overdrive cow thanks to 19 months. Headbutt for uppercut or whatever. Headbutt seems pretty good in this fight. The guardian fight. So if I ever get a damage card in my deck, it will be useful. This is fine. If Flame Barrier were a Watcher card, the buff would be permanent. And you'd be able to stack it. And it would hit for more. I'm just saying what we all know. It would be pressure points? Sure. <laughs> sure. That's not quite what I meant, but sure. Is there a reason why Seeing Red is so unsatisfying to play? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you were here? I think it's satisfying to play, I don't know. Can I deal 27 through a shield? Maybe. Need to deal 15? Yeah. This looks like a perfect guardian fight. And I leave Act 1 at 68 out of 68 health. <laughs> Legend's not actually that bad here. It's actually kind of okay. I have no card draw for Fiendfire. And also I sort of need an attack I can play more than one time. Oh yeah, if I get a Snekalai, it's like super good, but even if I don't get a Snekalai, it's pretty good. It's just the card that the duck needs. It needs a way to turn energy into damage. I guess it has a Flame Barrier plus. Uh, 
Another observation is that Bludgeon's sort of a shitty card, so I could also just not take a shitty card. Let's take Fiendfire. Cursed Key's okay. Not outstanding, but okay. Bludgeon is sort of card draw. Legend is like drawing three strike pluses at the same time or something. It's just, did you really want to draw strike plus repeatedly? Probably not. Maybe you did, I don't know, I'm not going to tell you what to do. <laughs> How many boss relics were better than curse key there? You. I did not have to play Seeing Red. I have four energy. This unfortunately still loses my buffer stack. Chat not exhaust me. Do I seem like I'm not exhausted by chat? That's good. I'm glad I seem that way. Yeah, I guess there aren't that many that are better than Cursed Key. Feels like an abnormally good Cursed Key. Legend would have been better that turn for those keeping track at home. And a flame not worth taking. It deals like zero damage ish. Generously. I have no strength scaling attacks. All of my attacks cost two. Carnage is an attack? I'm not going to buy a Carnage right now, though. There's no way. I'm just not going to do that. I just kill everything with Flame Barrier and Headbutt. That may actually be a reasonable way to kill Book of Stabbing right now for what it's worth. I don't know if I'm buying anything here. The relics are like, eh. Art of War is, eh. Probably not happening. It's not the worst Art of War, I guess. I could end up playing a deck that doesn't play attacks almost ever. But I'm not currently doing that, and I have this shop that I want to go to. Or maybe this one. We'll see. Metamorphosis is, in theory, three attacks. It's true. Could have taken Metamorphosis. I may have to smoke bomb this fight. That actually might be a thing right now. It's a feels bad moment. Yep. Well, if I smoke bomb this and then I get slavers, that might be sort of bad. Maybe we just take a bit of damage and hope that we're okay.
Sort of like that hand. I think Shrug on top was not actually helpful there. Also, I need to take one damage and didn't. And I can't this turn either. And take a lot of damage next turn. <laughs> um, yeah, definitely take a lot of damage next turn. Oh well. Actually, actually, book of stabbing, <laughs> you poor thing, <laughs> you, you poor, poor thing. I'll keep my buffer stack over dealing 14. That was every two cost card in my deck. Why is there a perfecto strike in my deck? To hit things. I play it on the enemies and it deals damage. Hard for me to do worse than that with the two flame barriers on my deck, that's for sure. But this should be like lethal ish. <laughs> that was great. I'm gonna take Exam. Ashes is really good because I didn't deal damage prior to picking that up, and now I sort of do. People say that you've fallen off. Otter, no. Don't listen to them. I still don't have a card draw. Like, I have zero card draws. It's not true. I have one shrug it off. Exhume sort of draws a card a little bit. <laughs> kind of. I could take Evolve. How do I beat Champ? With like a true grit? We take true grit to be champ. I sort of want to take sundial, actually. Let's take sundial. Zakalash, I'm doing alright. Which playlist is this? Oh. 
think it is things with thumbs up on them. That's unfortunate. I'm not gonna run away. 40, 53. Put a flame barrier on top first. Block for 20, which is enough. I could block for 24, which is even more enough. But then next turn's bad. I have 15 from these, plus 20, so 35. Also, oh, this dies next turn. Okay. Probably okay. Charred thinks for the four months. This fight's gone sort of poorly as it possibly could. And it seems like I'm still okay. Barrier might have been better on turn one, huh? Perfect. Strike is fine where it is. Don't spend a lot of time thinking that Perfected Strike needs a buff. Sort of not a card that you want to regularly be good. Legend is back. I'm not going to take it. I think I'm not opening this chest because I don't have enough gold to remove the curse of the store if it's bad. We'll deal with that next act. And do this thing. What would my effects be? If I were a card, ah, I am a card. I thought I was a saving smoke bomb in case I ran into slavers. I was, and it did the thing that I wanted it to do, which was be available if the fight went badly to save me. But the fight didn't go that badly, so. I have a strike dummy. <laughs> okay. The perfected strike build is still on. I need a true grip. I need one true grip. I don't like change. It's going all rightish. It's sleepy. Weird how I took a Dark Embrace and now my deck is good. I wonder if there's something to that. I found a True Grit.
How does the plant deal damage three times? Just attacks you three times? Oh, that's a good stretch. We're at 9 HP and struggling earlier. Were we though? Were we struggling or were we just at 9 HP? I think we might have not been struggling super much. I could take a reckless charge. I have Feel My Pain, Dark Embrace already. And Ashes. Provides copies of days for True Grit to exhaust. Reckless charge. True Grit a days in hand. Draw. I need an evolve though, don't I? I need an evolve. Hmm. I think it has enough potential to take, even if it's not quite working yet. Those do not kill champ. So I'm gonna end up with like shrug and nothing. Might have to take an inflame to be champ. That is disappointing. Disappointing to say the least. But I think I'm going to do it. Eggs. Okay. I'm also upgrading it. This is like not the proudest moment of my life. Great upgrade is okay sometimes. And I'm going to duplication potion it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's about where I'm at. He's timey. Don't do the metallicized shit. Damn it, champ. And the weakening me shit. Ugh. Ugh. One thing that Reckless Charge does is it gives me a six card starting hand next turn. Which could be a thing for getting a big second fiend fire off.
Unfortunately, these are cards I sort of want. So... I am currently not weak, though. How much do I not want them? Or how much do I do want them? Or whatever. I could play Shrug. Play True Grit. I think I sort of need Upper Gut. I'll survive the big attack. And then I'll have Exhum later. It seems fine. How's the run going so far? Funny you should ask. Don't do it, champ. Now my meat on the bone is active. Cool. Okay. I don't think we win that without Inflame, so... Great job, Inflame. I'm gonna take a Juggernaut so I actually deal damage, I think. Big Jugs. Trone, thanks for the 17 months. Hey, Guard Griffin. Got full Tungsten Rod value in that fight, yep. I could take Barricade instead. I don't think I actually generate a trillion block though. Which is weird because I'm taking Juggernaut. <laughs> I think I generate lots of small amounts of block, so Juggernaut seems good. I have Metallicize already, I have Feel No Pain already. And I need more damage. A lot of reasons. Runic Pyramid was maybe one of the ones that was better than Cursed Key. Good relic system. Gotta go here. I'm gonna have a curse stuck in my hand. I have Tungsten Rod to protect against pain, though. Normality could be run losing. He buffered butter balm. This is awkward. I wasn't planning on taking damage this time. But then I did something that took damage, so here we are. Is it ever anger? Cuties. Tiny attacks for tiny darklings. <laughs> I 
And Damien, thanks for the six months. Is Ashes a strong relic? Is Runic Pyramid a strong relic? These questions and more answered tomorrow. Today, brain off click cards. Astellini, thank you very much for the five months. You think so, but you're not sure. It's a very reasonable place to be. This is like okay, for sure. I think there's a huge amount of value in this 50 gold card remove. Could take offering, could take clockwork souvenir, or I could go to another shop. If I go to another shop, I get another card remove, which is honestly the most exciting part about it to me. Might be overvaluing card removes. Feel like Clockwork Souvenir sort of does a lot of what I'm expecting a card remove to do. Helps me out on turn two and three against the heart. Sorry to hear about your piercing, Vignari. I hope that it returns to us soon. Yeah, I know Sarance a lot. Entire world is in shambles. <laughs> you have a missing diamond. Hmm. That's weird. I wouldn't know anything about that. Havoc's a little bit too spooky to play, I think. It's really strong with Dark Embrace and Sundial, though. It might be such a strong card that I take it, even though it can hit Fiendfire sometimes. A lot of the time that it hits Fiendfire, it's actually not bad, to be honest. Okay. Fractal Magpie, thanks for 38 months. Appreciate it. Nothing personnel, kid. Weird how we know of one person who definitely didn't just look under their seat. I'm not gonna stand up. I didn't become a streamer so that I would have to stand up at work. That does not block it turns out. It's fine, there was no way of knowing. Also the fight is like comically over already so who cares?
You have to stand for six plus hours at work. See, this is this is why I do what I do instead of that. <laughs> nice hand. <laughs> um. Okay. Glad we're done with that bullshit. I'm gonna take another shrug so that I have an actual infinite. Although it's not even an infinite. It's like close to an infinite though. It blocks a lot. It's worth taking, I think. What's wrong with standing? Nothing wrong with standing. I just don't feel like standing right now. That's all. Our spines are meant for us to walk on all fours. Type whatever sequence of letters you can manage to type using only your nose if you're walking on all fours right now. I'm just curious. <laughs> hey, dark region. Y'all are such idiots. <laughs> Twitch chat, you're so fucking dumb. Oh, I love you. Jorb's bullying chat. I would never bully chat. You sure would be embarrassed to be the sort of streamer that attracts people like us? Yep. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's tough. Um, it's tough. How about a fire breathing? Just some repeating damage. I already have the Juggernaut. Should be enough. Chat, I wouldn't change you for the world. This nemesis has more health. Uh-oh. Did I change you for a bit of cash? Hmm. How much? How much cash, I guess? It's a tricky question. This kills, presumably. Oh, no. now it probably does. If I attracted a wealthier audience, it would get me more cash. God. Is that what I'm doing wrong? I feel like I'm doing all right with what I've got. Let's 
extension linger field thanks for the 15 months. Appreciate it. Hey. Hey, Altasane. You're at work with nothing to do. Same. Same, actually. I think I might just take another Dark Embers. Seems like an important card. Oh, does that, like, give me a True Grit Infinite now? Level Dark Embrace? Maybe. Play Reckless Charge, True Grit of Days. Doesn't actually work, right? But if I took Evolve, does it work? If I took Evolve and upgraded it? Sorry, my brain. I take a Volve and upgrade it. There's an Apicus. I don't need that. It's cool though. Just don't need it. Was streaming just for fun before? Um, before? The before times. The before times were a long time ago. I definitely did stream for fun at some point. Yes. I first got on Twitch because of a podcast that I was on. I think. Honestly, I don't remember how I got on Twitch. It was like a long time ago. Hey, Nostrum. I might have been on Twitch before then. Why did I... I think I just liked making shit online, and so I just made shit online. And then eventually it became a job. I was not on Justin.tv. I didn't get on Twitch and... <laughs> what? Alright, I'm glad we played the last 50 floors to improve our deck. Wish I had ice cream. Just in time to catch the start of the run. Hey, Volcanic. Good to see you. Oh, fuck. Did not do the math right there. I could headbutt Shrug on top or something. Though I'm going to draw the first card. Just Havoc. There are some hits I don't want. Play two Flame Barriers. Play two Flame Barriers seems okay.
What happens if I Dark Embrace Fiendfire? Dark Embrace Evolve Fiendfire. I don't need any of these cards. I wouldn't have hated exhuming Disarm, but I don't need to. Here is Munch. I would like to take two damage. This takes slightly more than two damage. Works for me, I guess. Now I'm taking five damage. Now I'm taking one damage. This is so confusing. <laughs> this is all over the place. Um, I should have an infinite now. So that's fun. are not quite lining up just yet. Next turn we're good though. So this is our 56 and full blocking. Fine. Song is a sandstorm by Daru. So I believe now if I do this and this, I'm just infinite. Oh, that was only one shuffle still. Uh-oh. Guess I'm not then. Why was that only one shuffle? Is there a way to make it more than one shuffle? I would need a card in my discard pile right now, I think. No. Maybe? No. Maybe it's just not quite infinite, but it doesn't matter because it's enough. That one was two shuffles. Think bottle. It sure seems like it's enough. If I Reckless Charge and then Havoc the days... I then draw Havoc or Reckless Charge with a minus one card. But I can like add that to my rotation and it works. So if I do this, this... Now we're minus one card. But then I like do this. It's weird because like ink bottle goes off sometimes. <laughs> this entire thing is so weird. This might actually be an infinite eventually, like if you play it right. Gosh, it's so bizarre. I want to go to 37. 
want to take two. Let's say this is close enough. Yeah, for having to play the same two cards 800 times for combat. What, you don't enjoy doing the same thing over and over again? That's weird. I can't relate. You fail to see why this isn't an infinite. Well, because it isn't an infinite. I am slowly losing energy. I'm just not losing energy very fast. That's all. It is a definite finite, yes. Does not yar. It was still an okay turn, even though my energy eventually ran out. Boof G. Thanks for the five months. Is Lannis Fire tearing complete? Depends on what you think it means for something to be tearing complete. It's definitely an it depends sort of situation. Does it do the work? Two shrugs is not enough. For Sundial to be infinite, you need a pommel plus. You need one card that draws two. That's why I thought evolve would be enough, but then it actually wasn't. There's no situation where you can reduce do I win this fight or something similar to the halting problem. Is that a question or a statement? Anyway, probably true. I probably want to keep a shrug in my deck. a statement that feels like a statement that cannot be proven so presumably that's the joke oh it was a joke okay i got it I don't actually get it, I'm very dumb, but I mean I do get it, but I don't get it, you know. I get it after Twitch chat explains it to me. Don't say that, Akadna. <laughs> you just didn't need to say that. <laughs>
Is Twitch chat tearing complete? Let's ask the real questions. Wait, this turn was like really bad. Am I just doing Reckless Charge Shrug for a bit? Is this two shuffles? Still no. This dazed goes in my draw pile. What about Shrug Trugrig? Obviously that's only one shuffle each card. Doesn't shuffle. Champagne throw. Glad you could catch a stream. Would I be infinite with another Dark Embrace? I don't think so. I don't think I need another Dark Embrace. I don't think that's the problem. Maybe though. Anyway, I think I just accidentally kill while I don't go infinite, so I'm not too worried about it all. A weakened one, worst act boss for speedruns. Probably true. This is a good card, arguably. Mad Cat would absolutely do it, yeah. Lots and lots of strikes and bashes in my opening hands recently. I think I'll save it for next fight. It's a lot of damage. The Fiend Fire. Seventeen plus twenty-eight. Can't really face this way though. the fight, no more damage taken. I said that very confidently. I think it's true. It was so good that you made it this far with only the Ironclad starter deck. It was hard, but uh, I did it. Right over back to full health. That seems not true, unfortunately. It would be nice if that were true.
What's that? Two shuffles? That is two shuffles. I have Nunchaku as well now. This is... Hmm. Hmm. Why, game? <laughs> you can beat the game with zero cards in your deck. If you feel so inclined. I just played double flame barrier. That would be very funny. Not sure it would be good. Watcher's starter deck is like pretty much the deck that you beat the heart with all of the time. Oh god. Suddenly I have cards on my hand. Quiet light. Do If I hit Fiendfire right now, it would be okay, I think. I think it would actually be okay. How many Dark Embraces do I have? Only one. Reckless Charge is an awkward one. That's an awkward one to hit. Oops. I think I want to hold this Seeing Red. Just do that. Okay, Fiend Fire. Okay, that's fine. You can be the bottom card. I don't mind. Why would I care? Do I seem like I care? I don't care. Fine by me. <laughs> oh. Just have enough block here. And I just exhaust slime. Sure. Or I could like do something better than that. I don't have to just like make a bad play that survives. I could try to make a better play.
think Havoc's okay. Definitely okay if it hits a strike. This block, 37, 41, 44, so I take 3, 3, 3, 3, doesn't block. And I can't shrug because uppercut dies. This is just mandatory fiend fire, I guess. Which doesn't leave me many cards, to be honest. There's not a lot left. I don't have to deal much damage though, just a hundred. I deal 50 damage a turn? Probably. There's no other line. I mean, if this doesn't win, I should shrug, but I think this wins. Uppercuts. Havoc. Over that shrug? Forgot. Oh yeah. That was a fun run.